Good morning. Welcome to chapel. It's so good to be here. But you're not here. Oh, that's right. It's that crazy virus. And so you're not here. And I want to tell you, we miss you. We wish you were here. And I hope you're safe at home. Are you at home? Oh, good. And so while we can't be together here in this place, I'm get glad that we can be together and worship our God through the internet. And so we are together. God's spirit is with us. He is with each and every one of us. And so we're going to worship together. And so we're going to begin with the call to worship like we always do. Your word, O Lord, is eternal. It stands firm in the heavens. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light for my path. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. We walk by faith, not by sight. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Amen. We'll continue with our first song. Good morning. That's Lindsay and Robbie. I'm Mark. Let's do this, can we? In my wrestling and in my doubt, in my you won't walk out Your great love will lead me through You are the peace in my troubled sea Oh, you are the peace in my troubled sea In the silence you won't let go In the questions your truth will hold Your great love will you are the peace in my troubled sea. Oh, you are the peace in my troubled sea. Oh, my lighthouse, my lighthouse, shining in the darkness, I will follow you. Oh, my lighthouse, my lighthouse, I will trust the promise. Safe to shore, safe to shore, safe to shore, safe to shore. I won't fear what tomorrow brings. With each morning, I'll rise and sing. My God's love will. You are the peace in my troubled sea. Oh, you are the peace in my troubled sea. Oh, my lighthouse, my lighthouse, shining in the darkness, I will follow you. Oh, my lighthouse, my lighthouse, I will trust the promise. You will carry me safe to shore. Safe to shore, safe to shore. Fire before us, you're the brightest. You will lead us through the storms. Fire before us, you're the brightest. You will lead us through the storm. Hey! Fire before us, you're the brightest. You will lead us through the storm. Hey! My lighthouse, my lighthouse, shining in the darkness, I will follow you. My lighthouse, my lighthouse, I will trust the promise. You will carry me safe to shore. Safe to shore. Safe to shore. Safe to shore. 
Well, this morning I want to talk about change. A lot of things have changed in the last week and a half. The first thing is you're at home doing online school. Do you like it? Is it going well? I hope so. Your teachers are working really hard to give you a good education experience, and so I hope you're really enjoying that. You're not here at school, and so you're not with your friends. I know that's hard for a lot of you, and so that's changed. Go to a restaurant. You can't go and eat inside a restaurant. You can get curbside, or you can go through the drive through but you can't go inside a restaurant. And we just heard that the Yuma County Fair, it's not going to happen this year. It's, it's uh, been canceled, and I know a lot of people are sad, especially if you have an animal, 4-H. And I know that, that change is hard and difficult. You know, there's just a lot of changes that are taking place. But today I'm going to talk about something that has, hasn't changed, that will never change, and that is God. God doesn't change. We just read earlier, Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And since Jesus is the Word of God, God's Word never changes. And so it's in times like this, we look to God's Word, we look to His promises, and we can count on them. We know that they will never change. And so this morning, I want you to just think of some things, some, some of the promises of God that don't change, some promises of God that will never change. One is God always loves us. Isn't that wonderful? God always loves us no matter what. He will love you all the time. Jeremiah 31 verse 3 says, The Lord appeared to us in the past, saying, I have loved you with an everlasting love. I have drawn you with loving kindness. God says in his word, I have loved you with an everlasting love. It's a love that is eternal. It will never go away. It will last forever. So no matter what you do, no matter what we do in life, we know that we have one who loves us, and that is God. He loves us all the time. Romans 8, 39 says nothing, and it lists a whole bunch of things, but nothing will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. And so we know that nothing in this world, nothing at all could ever separate us from God's love. God loves you so much. Another Bible passage that you know is John three sixteen. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life. God so loved the world. God so loved you that he gave his only son son. That's the promise there, and we know that. There is a picture of Jesus on the cross, and that's God loved us so much that he sent Jesus into this world of sin and death. He, he paid for your sin and my sin. He died the death that we deserved, and he did it all for us out of love for us. While we were still sinners, the Bible says, Christ died for us. And we know that the really good news is that even though Jesus died three days later, he rose again, he is alive, and now because he lives, we know God is with us. God is always with us. There's another promise, Deuteronomy 31, verse 6. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you or forsake you. Yeah, we have a God who lives in us by his spirit. He has given us faith in Jesus Christ when we were baptized. He has given us forgiveness of sins. He has given us life with him, not just today, but forever. And so he says, I will never leave you or forsake you you. There's empty classrooms. The playground's empty. Oh, I'm missing you guys play on the playground. It's empty. The chapel is empty. Oh, we miss being together in worship together. You know, we're not here together, but God is always with us. Isaiah 41 verse 10 says, So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. So God says, fear not. I am with you. I am your God, and I will always be with you. God always protects us. John chapter 10, verses 28 to 30, another great Bible passage. It says, I give them eternal life, and they shall never perish. No one can snatch them out of my hand. My Father who has given them to me is greater than all. No one can snatch them out of my Father's hand. I and the Father are one. 
God always protect us, protects us. That's a great promise, isn't it? We know that Jesus is the good shepherd and he watches over us, he guards us, he protects us, he leads us the right direction, he gives us what we need, and so we know that our God is with us. And no matter what we go through, no matter what we face, we have a God who is with us and it says no one can snatch us out of our Father's hand. No one can take the faith that God has given us away from, from us. And so we know that we have a God who protects us and is with us. So while there's a lot of changes that are taking place in our world right now, in your life and in my life, we know God doesn't change, his word doesn't change, and we can rely on that. Please pray with me. Heavenly Father, we do thank you that you are our God who doesn't change. We know that we are going through many changes today, but you are with us. And so we pray, Lord, that you would remind us always that you love us, that you are with us, and that you will protect us. Thank you for being our God. Thank you for loving us and giving us this new life. And thank you that we can be together by your spirit, even though we are not together face to face. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So right now we will sing our next song. I walk by faith. You ready? One, two, one, two, three. trust in you I walk by faith each step by faith to live by faith I put my trust in you every step I take is a step of faith no weapon formed against me shall prosper every prayer I make is a prayer of faith if my God is for me who can be against me I walk by faith each step by faith to live by faith, I put my trust in you. I walk by faith, each step by faith, to live by faith, I put my trust in you. I walk by faith, each step by faith, to live. I put my trust in you. I put my trust in you. Oh, yeah! We go to our God in prayer. Heavenly Father, we do thank you that while we're not together, we are together by your Spirit. 
Lord, we pray for our teachers. We thank you for the gifts they are to our school and to our children. Thank you for all the work they've done to put together online school. We pray that you would continue to bless them, give them the wisdom that they need, and just thank you for giving them the technology to use to connect with our students in this way. Lord, we thank you for our students. We thank you for the learning that is going on at home. We pray that you would be with them and their parents. We ask that you would help them to grow in their education and more than that, grow in their love for you as well. We thank you that they continue to learn even though we're not together in this place. Lord, we also thank you for our parents and grandparents. We thank you for the special gift they are to their children. We ask that you would be with them, continue to protect them and be with them, give them everything that they need for their children and for their homes. Lord, we just thank you for the wonderful gift they are to their families. Lord, we also thank you for our military, for our border patrol, for our first responders, for doctors and nurses, for all those, all those people who put themselves in harm's way to protect us and keep us safe. We especially pray for those uh, who are working on the front lines in the hospitals and uh, in doctor's offices. We pray that you would watch over them, that you would protect them and keep them from getting ill. And Lord, we pray for all those who are sick. We ask that you would bring healing to them. We pray that you would be with them and, and ask that you would uh, give them your health. Lord, we also pray for all those who are fearful today. We know that because of the changes that would take place in the world, there are many people who are afraid. We pray, Lord, that they would know who you are and to know with you they have nothing to fear because you have given them life. And so we pray that uh, you would take away their anxiety or fearful thoughts and give them your peace. Lord, we thank you for not only hearing our prayers, but answering them in the name of Jesus Christ, who has taught us to pray, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. And just again, before we close, I just want to thank you that we joined together in this way. I just want to again remind you that we miss you. I can't wait to see your faces again, and know that God will bless you. And so may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be and stay with you all. Amen. Go in peace and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. And we'll sing our final song. Come set your rule and reign in our hearts again. Increase in us, we pray. Unveil why we're made Come set our hearts ablaze with hope Like wildfire in our very soul Holy Spirit, come invade us now We are your church We need your power in us We seek your kingdom first We hunger and we thirst Refuse to waste our lives For your our joy and prize To see the captive heart released The hurt, the sick, the poor at peace We lay down our lives for heaven's call your church we pray revive this earth build your kingdom in let the darkness fear show your mighty hand heal our streets and land set your church on fire win this nation back change the atmosphere build your kingdom in. we pray 
Unleash your kingdom's power Reaching near and far No force of hell can stop Your beauty changing heart You made us for much more than this Awake the kingdom seed in us Fill us with the strength and love of Christ We are your church We are the hope on earth Build your kingdom Build your kingdom in. Let the darkness fear Show your mighty hand Heal our streets and lands Set your church on fire Win this nation back Build the atmosphere Build your kingdom in. We pray 